Hello kids, today you will learn about art making in Scratch. You can make digital art like a professional using various programming palettes and your artistic mind. With only a few clicks, you can import music or picture files into Scratch. You may customize your project by creating characters for your story, obtaining and altering photos from the internet and importing or recording sounds or music. You may quickly remix an existing project with Scratch. You can build or alter a project if you like it. You may copy and paste code or pictures from other projects into your own or you can download and edit an example project or any other project in the Scratch community. The Scratch Cat or the Sprite is on the right while the programming palette is on the left in Scratch. You program your Sprite by dragging blocks from the programming palette into the script in the middle of the screen. Start with a move block such as move 10 steps. Then try connecting your initial block with others such as turn 15 degrees block. To make the sprite move, double click on your blocks. Using the change color effect by 25, you can alter the color of your sprite every time you click your stack. Drag a forever block out of the control blocks. Drop it on top of the stack to insert your old blocks into the forever blocks mouth. Your script will now continue to execute until you hit the stop button. You can also begin your program by pressing a single key. Try pressing the space bar after snapping on the when space bar key is pressed. The next thing you will see is your sprite whirling and changing colors fast. Click one of the three boxes below the stage to add sprite. Choose a sprite from your computer's file system or the scratch library to paint a sprite or get a surprise sprite. To change the backdrop, go to the stage tab and select backgrounds to sketch, import or choose from the scratch library. After you have saved your project, click share to share it with the scratch community. If you want to learn scratch in detail, book a demo with us now. Until next time, keep learning how to code.